Lord Amber Maze. What is it? Let's find out. So let's check the settings really quick, make sure everything looks good. Why is it set? See, why is it set so high? It shouldn't it shouldn't be set at that, but oh well, it is what it is. That, that, that's what we want right there. All right, video control sound. We'll bump the sound up a little bit too. It is kind of quiet. All right, that should be better. And new game. Sill and Shantae went fishing as they always did on Mondays. In Amberwave, every resident was a good fisherman. Either you knew how to catch fish or you went hungry. Why did the storm start earlier than usual? It's well known that the Amber storm begins at 6 o'clock solar time. The waves carried the boat further and further away from the city. Like a speck of sand, fighting the Amber storm was futile. No wonder they, they scare misbehaving children with it. If you misbehave, the storm will take you away, and the evil lord will claim you. After the storm, the entire shore was covered in amber, as if someone had left bait. Eager fishermen looking for a catch often ventured into the heart of the storm in search of treasure. But no one ever returned. Today on the cold stones in the dungeon, Zen remembered how his grandmother had told him the legend of the evil lord in the amber castle full of treasure, but the treasure should w could wait. His, his priority was to find Shantae. Shanti? Shanti. At that moment, a massive sword appeared nearby. Zen wasn't a warrior, but when he took the sword in his hands, he felt a surge of power. It was as if years of training had passed in a second. What kind of magic was this? The little bit I do know this is turn-based. Though, I'm genuinely curious to see how the dungeon stuff is going to work in a turn-based setting. But long last, it's been a while since anyone stumbled into the Amber Storm. Congratulations, novice. You've fallen into Lord Amber Maze's trap. I'll be your mentor. My name is Varian. My name is Zin. Wait a moment. Varian? My grandmother used to tell me about you. The same Varian who was the first to embark on the quest for the Lord's treasure. You're a legend in Amberwave, but that was so long ago. You must be falling apart from old age by now. Hey kid, we'll see who falls apart first. Time on the island flows differently than in the outside world. You'll feel it soon enough. The island gives people special abilities. Mine is telep telepathy. Telepathy, yeah. Well, I'm not planning to run after you. After all, I'm quite old and might fall apart. Hope you make it to at least the green forest. Even that rarely happens. Okay, so movement. <clears throat> it kind of has a Crypt of the Necro Dancer looking vibe to it. Okay, that's teleportation. How do we attack? Okay, so you cannot kick the. Ch oh, we need is a key. So we also have money. Oh, actually, wait. Nope, can't do anything with that. All right, so we go forward. Falling in water into the abyss deals damage. So watch your movement. Enemies move simultaneously with you. Skip a turn. Poisonous plum. Got him. Ah, you jerk. Okay, that gives us health. Good. Oh, shoot. We died already. Wow, okay. We still can't open that thing. Oh, once you die, you start over. It's the tutorial. No way. No way it's that freaking tough. No way it's that freaking tough. Oh, shoot. You absolute jerk. Gosh, dang it. Okay, I don't know what to do here. And we can't teleport yet, either. 
so confused by this. So the money drops every single time. I think I'm already stuck in this game. And you have to kill the enemies. There's no way to avoid them. So that could be a problem. That could be a problem. I don't like the way they move. How? How do you... Oh my gosh. There we go, money. Open closed chest with a golden key. All right, so we can select a room. Uh, teleport? All right, how do we teleport? I don't think we can yet. Okay, let's go back to this. Wait, it doesn't let me do it. Okay, got him. Good, good, good. Yes! Okay, now we can teleport. So we can go back here. And now hopefully we can open this chest. Get more money. Lots of money. Alright, let's do this. We'll go up this. I'm glad it's saving, too. Okay, we need another key. That's money. What else do we got over here? Can we break these? No. Oh shoot! I got a heart! I got a freaking heart! How did it... I have to say, I'm not a massive fan of the... Oh, yes! Give me healing. Ah, shoot! Oh, we got him! Got him! I don't know how we survived, but we did. Spike steel da double damage to all creatures. Shoot! Of course. Of course. Why not? Okay, this game is kind of frustrating. Just a little bit. Okay, we got them. How are you supposed to get good at this? I just think I'm not good. I am not good. Ow! This game is tough! Oh my gosh! This has to be one of the tougher rhythm-based games I've played that I can remember. Man. Yeah, we got we got to freaking avoid those idiots. Got him. More money. What do we do with the money? Oh, shoot! No way. Okay, that's it. That's it. I give up. I'm bad. That's all it is. I'm just bad. So yeah, this is Lord Amber Maze. If you like a challenge, you will probably really enjoy it. If you are horrible at specific games like me, you may have more of a difficult time. <laughs> just be prepared to potentially not only struggle a lot, but die a lot, and also have your progression halted very often. I've never been great at rhythm, 
for the most part, unfortunately. So that's probably why I'm really struggling. My rhythm is really off offbeat. Like, it's just, I'm not good at it. But uh, you may enjoy this. If you love rhythm, if you're great at being in sync, you will probably excel at this game. But yeah, Amber Maze, Lord Amber Maze, I will drop the link in the description if you'd like to check it out. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you next time.